The main purpose of my role here is to test the raw materials that go into roads and other construction efforts of MDOT before they even get to the end user. For the cements and flashes, we do what's called a loss of ignition test, which is kind of like what it sounds. You basically put it in an oven at a given temperature and see how much mass disappears. For those, we also test how fine they are, how small the particle size is. Um, we do that through sieve analysis. We also do x-ray analysis to find out the elemental composition before us, which is the instrument behind me at the moment. On the glass beads that we run, we do what's called a roundness test to see what percentage of them are round because that way they mix into the paint better and also helps with their reflectivity. We also test the wood that goes into the fences and stuff on the sides of the road to make sure they have the right chemical content for uh, bacteria and bug abatement. We do that through the x-ray machine as well. The paints, we test things like viscosity and specific gravity just to make sure that they have the right materials in them. And just whatever other specs is, are set by the state. The way the traveling public will see it is we're ensuring that the materials that go into roads and other construction done by MDOT are going to be there for the long haul to make sure that you're not getting a bad product. Once it's put down, it's going to look good and it's not going to crack and be there for a good number of years before you have to repave them. I try to say, take each of them with equal importance because they're all going into a project that could affect the quality of the roads, which in the end really could affect whether or not some, someone's life. You know, because if a road get a big crack in a road that they didn't expect, it could be deadly. And I try to take it that seriously that I need to do my job right.